Today we're drinking the Beekeeper Honey Wheat Beer that we made. What I noticed when I poured is I like the color a lot and it's pretty nice and clear. It's the color of honey, pretty much. It is. It's an interesting smell from what I can smell because of this cold. Oh yeah, you should probably explain that, Dave, that you're sick and that's why you sound stupid and look stupid. <laughs> I sound stupider and look stupider because I have a cold, so I can't taste very good, I can't smell very good, and I can't talk very good. It does have an interesting smell and I can't put my finger on what it is exactly. I like it though. It smells good. Yeah, it's not bad. I like the color. I like the clarity. Let's see if I like the flavor. Yeah. It's not bad. I thought with the amount of honey malt that we put in it that it would have more pronounced honey flavor. Yeah, the honey doesn't really come through in the flavor. Unfortunately, it doesn't. It is a little sweet. Yeah, it has sweetness, just no honey flavor that, no. I, that I detect. Yeah, it's good. I would drink a couple of them, but it wasn't exactly what we were shooting for. Yeah. So, decent beer, not what we were aiming for. So, I'm disappointed, not because it's bad, just because it wasn't the the result I was looking for. It's a good beer. Today, we're drinking the Beekeeper Honey Wheat, and Kyle's mean to me. I guess you could say that it's not quite the bee's knees. Maybe bee's elbows. <laughs> it's the bee's elbows. Kyle, I gave the luchador a sombrero. Wow.